Teddy Bridgewater enters the summer with the goal of joining his fourth NFL team in four years, according to ESPN. Even though he has a reputation as a journeyman quarterback with limited upside, he's expected to garner a lot of interest from teams in need of a quarterback this offseason. The NFL free agency period will open again for Bridgewater, who signed a $63 million contract with the team just two years ago. While injuries and inconsistency stop Bridgewater from doing more with the Denver Broncos and Carolina Panthers, he has still shown that he's a starting caliber quarterback in both situations. We're entering a period in which there are more teams than ever wanting to improve their signal calling, and we've identified a few potential landing sites for Teddy Bridgewater to consider. So here are four insane free agent spots for Teddy Bridgewater in 2022. At number 4, the New York Giants. The New York Giants are taking the right steps in the right direction. Brian Dable is the ideal coach for developing a playbook that will allow Daniel Jones to perform at the level of a viable starting quarterback. Front desk personnel also have expressed a strong desire to put together a stronger supporting cast for the signal caller in command. Jones, on the other hand, has shown that he is unable to maintain consistency, and it is highly conceivable that he may be benched or injured at some point during the 2022 season. Teddy Bridgewater is introduced. He's the ideal short-term solution for the Giants' offensive line, which has been completely rebuilt. The veteran quarterback will make accurate throws to Kenny Galladay, Saquon Barkley, and Kadarius Toney at the right time in the game. Despite the fact that he does not have a high ceiling for the Giants, Bridgewater will not be the type to lose games on his own like Jones. Furthermore, his performance will allow New York to conduct a thorough evaluation of the talent on the offensive side of the ball before picking its franchise quarterback of the future. At number 3, the Cleveland Browns. The Cleveland Browns have lost faith in quarterback Baker Mayfield. A public commitment to the former number one overall pick as the starting quarterback next season exists, but the organization is looking into other options. It's not a given that Mayfield will be traded, but he will almost certainly have competition for the starting job in training camp. Given Mayfield's resume, it's possible that Bridgewater will not be selected for the starting job at training camp. However, he is more than capable of taking his place when Mayfield, as is certain, throws a series of interceptions that prove to be detrimental. Cleveland already has a dominant rushing offense and a strong offensive line, so this should not be a problem. This may be a fantastic fit for Bridgewater if the team invests its first-round picks on pass catchers. At number 2, the Pittsburgh Steelers. In an ideal world, the Pittsburgh Steelers would either sign Aaron Rodgers or Deshaun Watson to their roster. The franchise, on the other hand, lacks the draft capital and cap room necessary to recruit an exceptional quarterback. When it comes to Jimmy Garoppolo, a franchise that rarely trades high-end picks would certainly choose a free agent option to trading a day two pick for the quarterback in question. In the case of a rookie quarterback, Bridgewater is the ideal bridge starter. It's worth noting that Malik Willis is allegedly a fan favorite in Pittsburgh. Willis is a player worth targeting in the first round, but there is a general agreement in the NFL in circles that he will not be ready to play in the league's inaugural season in 2022. Bridgewater is a step above Mason Rudolph and might have the Steelers contend for a playoff spot next season if they can rely on their defense and Najee Harris to get them through the season. And at number one, the New Orleans Saints. Despite the absence of Sean Payton from the squad, the New Orleans Saints are an excellent destination for Bridgewater's career. He is well versed in offensive coordinator Pete Carmichael's scheme, which is an important consideration as the Saints analyze their quarterback prospects in the coming weeks. Also noteworthy is the fact that he is well liked in the locker room. When Breeze went down with an injury in 2019, Bridgewater stepped in and performed admirably as the starter. When it came to pinpoint accuracy, he made it possible for the Saints playmakers to make things happen and the offense appeared to be effective. The Saints are aware of his limitations and would place him in an environment that would allow him to achieve to the greatest extent possible. There is only one thing that stands in the way of a reunion, the Saints cap situation. Well guys, thank you so much for tuning in. Be sure to smash that like button, subscribe to the channel, and hit that notification bell so that you never miss a video. We'll see you guys next time.